What is up guys? Welcome back to Weeb's Closet. My name is Jake. I am currently reacting to Castlevania Season 4 and we are actually on Episode 3 now. Last episode got a reintroduction to Lenore uh, as well as Hector and Carmela. Carmela seems just hell-bent on taking over the world which is totally fine. She was always uh, very crazy. Uh, Lenore seems very conflicted about what she wants. I assume that she's going to turn more good. She's sort of like uh, in this weird gray area as of right now. Uh, Trevor and Cypher are currently tracking down the people who are uh, trying to bring trying to bring Dracula back to life and those people that are trying to bring Dracula back to life are now after this underground royalty group that have a ton of like hidden treasures and magic that they think will bring Dracula back to life so it's like kind of this weird triangle thing so Belmont and Sypha are trying to get in touch with uh, this, this underground group basically uh, so a lot of stuff is actually going on now still curious what Alucard is up to and as well as Isaac I see in the description We're actually gonna get to see Isaac. I probably shouldn't read that before the episode because it kind of gives stuff away But nonetheless gonna start the episode now and Begin Pretty girl, then. Who's a pretty girl? That's right, you are. <laughs> what are you looking at? He told us to place possessions to aid later identification if need be. I needed to see if it still works. <laughs> How precious. Weepy. So last time I checked, Isaac was also building an army of sorts in Season 3. Again, I don't really remember a whole lot about Season 3. It was like a year and a half ago. It's like The Sims. But with demons. May I ask you a question? Of course. What are we doing here? That is a very broad question. Be more specific. Would you like a berry? Case in point, I am a night creature. I <laughs> eat blood and meat. A His voice is very unsettling. Not kill you. Night creatures do the will of their forge masters. Then, perhaps... I simply don't understand your will. Ask your question. We kill, destroy, and despoil. You have us burying the rotten dead. Why do you have us going against our nature? Have a berry. <laughs> Just eat the berry, goddammit. Memories. It's not blood or meat, but you don't appear to have died from it. It could be resettled. Once the bodies are buried, the debris is disposed of, and the structures are repaired. We will be moving on soon. Would you like another berry? I think so. Take one. May I make an observation? You may. You are changing. There is still revenge <clears throat> in you, I think. But other things, too. That conversation was seven minutes long and it felt like 30 seconds. I just really hooked me he might have a point i think that's why i've been bringing up isaac so much before and after every episode is because i i think he's one of my favorite characters just his philosophies are really interesting and City. he's definitely he one of the most ruthless characters in the show those two destroyed to convert is it so bad to take my time and think for a moment You 
Mirror. What is yeah. this? Do you not remember me? You do not look memorable. I'm Coxman. Barney, Barney of Dracula's original cohort. Why are you connecting to my mirror, Varney? I have spoken with people who marked your passage across the land. You've done great work, sir. Do not allow this one to call me again and go to sleep. Fuck you. <laughs> He cut me off. Don't know how I feel about the the Varney character yet. I changed my mind. Have soldiers carry me around the countryside on a bed. I was making a joke. Are you suddenly doubting me after all this time because your legs are sore from living my life? Are you ready to fight the same war over and over again for the rest of your life? You want to know what I think? Always. I think that whatever we achieve, we achieve it together. You and me. Carmilla throws a crazy plan at us and it's us who make it work. But we've been out here for weeks away from her and her madness and I'm telling you... Oh. What's happening? They know what we are. Apparently they're not stupid. I need to get to my trunk. That one? You never opened that. What's in it? Make haste. Day armor. Get in the trunk. No. Day armor. Arrows can't pierce it and light can't get in. Get in the damn trunk, love. That looks badass, I can't lie. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. Oh wow, yeah. I have a new favorite character now. She just punched a horse in the face. I'm not gonna lie, this episode was moving pretty slow at first, but... This is feeling like Dark Souls right now. With the giant sword and body armor. She doesn't even need them. She's destroying the competition. I take it we won. Yes. Yeah. Good. I want to kill you myself. We're in the cold light of day. <laughs> and Carmilla's grand plan. The humans are going to fight for their place in the world. Constantly. In the cold light of day, I have to ask myself this. Do I want this? Sisters, Hector is finally ready to start making night creatures. Come home. It begins. So I guess this is the resistance, or lack thereof. What I don't understand is, Dracula hit it first when his wife died here, right? But it's still infested with vampires and night creatures. What's the end game here? Hmm? What do they get? Which means we are here for a reason. Not sure how we fit into this. Fit. Hmm. Huh. A 
I want to be certain you can be trusted first. That's good. Because we want to make sure we can trust you first. We have important matters to discuss too. In the meantime, we're going to take a good long look at how you failed to do any of that so far. And whether we're going to choose to help you. <laughs> Alright, fine! She does need our help. Walk away. So, pretty slow episode compared to uh, the last two, for sure. That was actually a really long episode. Wow, that was, that was like a 20, 26 minutes long, I think. A lot of it was conversation between characters. That sequence in the middle with, I can't remember what her name was, but that was that was crazy. That was like the best action of the entire season. Uh, finally got a look at Isaac. He's still crazy. And it looks like Carmela is bringing all the vampires back together to kind of form a bigger team to do her crusade thing that she's going to do. I don't know how that's going to tie in with what Trevor, Sypha, and Alucard are doing, but we shall see. And that will do it for this episode on the Weebs Closet, and I will see you later. Thank you guys for joining us on another Weebs Closet reaction. If you liked the video, please hit that like button, leave a comment below, and subscribe to stay up to date with our latest videos. See you in the next one.